before this video begins I'd like to give a huge thanks to my channel members who you can see on screen now. Become a member by hitting the join button and get your name here among other awards today. Hello there and welcome back to some more Forza Mode Sport 3. Today we're continuing on Let's Play. This is episode 135 and today's episode we are taking a look at the Class R2 North American Tour. For that we need an R2 car and the car we're using today it's a racing Corvette. We've had to do this again um, because I'm an idiot. Anyways, 2007 Chevrolet number 4 Corvette Racing C6R. I am an idiot because I forgot to unmute my mic on the Elgato and... Yeah. You... I, I have no word. Yeah. I just Class R2 have... North American Tour. Ultra high-end prototype race cars from Class R2 compete on North American tracks. Maple Valley reverses first. Yeah. Thankfully, we caught... Or rather, Chaser, shout out to you, sir, caught it. Um, or oh, ma'am, I don't actually know. Um, whatever you want to be this week. Um, thank you for catching this by watching the stream. He is now... You see, Emil, this... This... Me. <laughs> This is why sim racers just piss themselves in the middle of a race instead of going to the bathroom. Yeah, fair point. So otherwise if this happens. To be fair, to be fair, I could have left the mic on because absolutely nothing interesting happened. Everything, everyone's asleep in the house, and all I did was move the alpha, uh, do something outside, and then sat on the toilet and watched some Jeremy Kyle. Uh, anyways. What? Why did that you? That sounds like a normal Friday for you, Emil. It's Thursday. <laughs> It's Thursday, mate. <laughs> <laughs> it's a bit on time, buddy. It's still a normal Friday. Oh, dude, I love the McLaren F1. Hello. Well, I'll be right back, lad. Okay, hi. Hi. Why are you here? Oh. You should be in bed. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. Nah. Hello, Ludo. Nah, nah, I am a goose. Oh. You sound drunk. Are you drunk? So no, I I'm, hope he's drunk. I'm not drunk. I did drink a bit, but I'm not drunk. I went. So I'm you are drunk. drunk. No, no, I'm not drunk. Yes. No, you I'm drunk just, a bit, uh, therefore uh, uh, you are drunk. I'm just fucking Dude, mad. don't fucking argue with me. Yeah, yeah, listen, I'm fucking mad. You wanna know what those fucking cunts at the dealership that sold my car did? No, no. They, did, they didn't give me the fucking shit to get the lug off a wheel. Oh. So yeah, I, I, oh, that'll be why you've resorted to drinking. <laughs> no, 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 no. I, I, no, no, no I, I have grounds for a fucking lawsuit. <laughs> I actually didn't resort to drinking, I mean I went out to people I know and we went to... I prefer my head cannon. And we went at the restaurant and all and I drank, but that's not the thing. I went back home, I, you know, I slightly eat a car which can happen, so I turn my tire. And I, I go, uh, it, it was close to home, so I go back home and, and I'm like, I have a spare tire. I'm just going to put that in and I will get to the shop to get it, fucking the new, new tires and shit. I, I go to get, I get the spare tire off, everything off, and I go to try to get the, the fucking puncture tire off. None of the fucking tool they gave me does fit the fucking nose. I can't so get I'm guessing thing. today hasn't quite been your day. Well, to be fair, it? I have a similar issue that might arise very shortly. What? But because uh, my car has wheels, obviously. Tired. No. However, no way. the guy who sold it to me made a big deal about the fact that he went to a Honda dealership and bought new lug nuts for it, like locking wheel locks. Yeah. So yeah. I don't know if that means that the, the it doesn't have any on it currently, or the tool's <laughs> gone missing and it needs a new one. Either way, the uh, packaging is apparently split and they're sort of all gathered around the boot floor somewhere now. So that's fun. Um, yeah. Well, you know, I And also, it. it's gonna need new rear tires because I pumped the tire full of air today, and, uh, mm. Yeah, When yeah, your driver's they... side rear tire is supposed to be at 30 psi and it was at 12, you know there's I a mean, bit of an I mean, issue. I mean, I mean, I mean my, <laughs> mine, 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 12. Mine isn't at 12, it's at zero. Ah. It's freaking flat. And I cannot get it off, even though I have a fucking spare wheel that I could put in on it. Nice. Because, yeah. Drive to the so, wheel shop really slow. Here's an yeah. idea. Why don't you just get some masking tape, right? Stick the steering wheel next to your actual wheel and just mask them together. No, actually, actually you, you know, that might sound dumb, but I might have a freaking idea, which is basically... Hang on, Ludo, is it a front tire or a rear tire? Front. Oh, fuck, you can't put it on Mackie's trays. Yeah, 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 you, you, 
You know why it's fucking annoying? I have front wheel drive car, so losing front tire is not the best thing ever. I'm gonna no, go you... and get some better tires at some point soon. I, That's I, a good I, idea. Oh uh, yeah, yeah, but you see the problem. I, I have to do 40 kilometers with the car tomorrow, <laughs> technically. But yeah, you can't. You thought. Never I mean, see I mean, uh, You'll never unsee uh, one. I mean, I can surely get get out of doing those kilometers and doing it in another way. But I I I have for sure need to go to the fucking shop. Paris to, to Marcel every time I hear him. Oh god. Yeah, I have to fucking get that fucking car to fucking pay off in some way. I Good luck. recommend that axe. I mean, I mean, I'm not going to do it, Emil. I'm going to do to go slowly to the tire shop. It's not that far away. Scotia, what's your review of locking wheel nuts? Pain in the ass. <laughs> Scotia doesn't have an opinion. Yeah. Scotia. First mod I did to my car. Take the fuckers off. Why? You need them. Someone might steal your 15-inch Subaru wheels. <laughs> Oh you no, then I'll have an excuse to oh, upgrade! You, want... <laughs> you, you right. want my review? Yes. Yeah. If you have them, go fuck yourself. <laughs> I have I'm... two pairs of them, what do you think of that? I'm back. Go fuck yourself to it twice as hard. I mean, uh, I don't even know. That's kinda hot. Uh, uh, how do you know that it's looking weird? Not... Actually, oh, better, yeah, get get uh, Lucifer, Lucifer Sam to fuck you instead. N no, that's what Tinder's for. No, called. I, I, uh, my uh, car uh, wouldn't uh, even do hey, hey, guys, guys, how do you know it's Exactly. Exactly. How do you know it's actually looking real nuts? If you tried to put your tie wire on them and it didn't go. <laughs> yeah, then, then, then that's fucking looking real nuts. All, yeah. four, all four of them, and they don't have the fucking tool, I think. Besides, yeah, go to your, go to your tire plate. To be fair, oh. on my yeah. on my um, Facebook swaps and sales, they had a four Subaru wheels for that car. They're exactly the same for fifty quid, so including Fuck. tires. So. How <laughs> bad yeah. tires? No. Oh, I don't yeah, fucking bad care. I just saw, like, mate, it's four alloy wheels, for fifty quid. <laughs> to be fair, the Subaru fifteen alloy. Well, yes, because people throw them away so they can make HTI rep as dickhead. <laughs> At least you have a car. I mean, Mine's going to be what to buy a guy I named mean, Brad. Brad? Yeah, <laughs> <you do. Brad? laughs> uh, of course, I that's mean, the name of who works on the Saab. Uh, broken Brad. Uh, I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean, the good side of Brad. The, the, the good, si good side right. of good side of thing. The tear shop is only 2.3 kilometers away, so if I drive slowly with running on, I should be able to get there without. That's like 0.1 of a mile in like English, so that's good. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I mean, I mean, I mean, it's not, it's not that far. Yeah, it's not that far, just, even in real units. I mean, I, I, I just have to, to go slowly, I guess. But that's that's sure that I'm not doing the 30 kilometers I have to. Today on the highway, I'm not going to want 130 kph with that. You're fucking Ludo pulling you over from the Persia 306. I reckon Ludo would be a good law enforcement man. Nah, no, you won't. I'm arresting you for drink driving. You're drunk driving as well. Shit, I'm arresting me as well. <laughs> no, <it'll be> like... <laughs> I, I, I'm not. I'm not drunk driving. I'm it's, not... it's like it's, gonna, it's like that family guy skit where uh, Peter pulls over Joe. Yeah. <laughs> Oh yeah, that one. That one's great. <laughs> uh, uh, I'm, I'm Have you been I'm, drinking tonight, sir? No, I just had a glass of dinner with my wine. <laughs> All right, I mean, you're drunk. You had to get out of the car. Now I'm gonna. I mean, now I'm gonna get in, hey in your Peter. car. <laughs> I, I'm not drunk. I, I, I'm just mad. Because fucking hell, I, 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 I have a fucking spare wheels. I don't have an, a fucking way to change it. Luda, when aren't you mad? <laughs> When he's getting Bro, pussy. <laughs> Listen, hey, 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 you wanna know the worst? <laughs> was the last time that happened? Never. You wanna, Never, you wanna, yeah. you, you, wanna you, you wanna know the worst about that? It's not even one of what, those. getting pussy or the tire? Nah, 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 shut up, I mean, it's, it's that my spare wheel, my spare wheel is not one of those slim shitty spare wheels that you cannot, can barely use, it's actually a full, a full size tire. Oh. <laughs> 
yeah, and I can't even put the fucking thing on because I don't have anything to get the lug nuts off because oh, they didn't gave it to me. So yeah, Good job. fucking wheel nut. I told yeah, someone. That's just incompetence. Thing. Yeah, I bugged the fucking car and they didn't even give me the lug. <laughs> Like Why is this race made up entirely of fucking Celines? <laughs> I, I, I feel think like I, I'll leave. This is like supercar brassers. Yeah. <laughs> I, I think I have a reason to hate this train now. They didn't they didn't give me the fucking anti leg nut thing. I didn't realise you bought it from a Citroen dealer. Uh well technically it was uh, the Citroen dealer of the Citroen they don't they don't sell them the main dealer anymore because nobody wants them. What year is your car anyway? Uh, Citroen C4. No, what year? Oh, 2011. It's the, the, it's the year they switched from the really cool looking body style to the really shite looking body style. <laughs> As you know, it doesn't look shite, it just looks really boring. There's yeah, a yeah, 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 Emil, and then they did that thing called the cactus, and mine already Wait, got... the cactus? Yeah, the C4 yeah. cactus is a cool car. Yeah, he has foam yeah. on the side uh, of it. <laughs> I, I, I mean, I mean, the un well, one thing I, there is one thing I don't like with the C4 cactus and the new Citroën is how they fucking divide the headlights, <laughs> like the f two small thing on the top and the big fat thing in the middle, like white. I like the C4 cactus because it's my sort of car. It's comfy as fuck. It's comfy. Wait, and you like Citroën? I like the cactus. That's crap. Citroen have made some good other? cars, like the like Xantia and the Saxo and the <laughs> XM the and the cactus Zara. But yeah, but I like, but I like the uh, XM for some reason because it's interesting. The XM's XM's hilarious. Like blowing up. Mm. What but was yeah, the one Clarkson used? The BX, CX, and the one. No, it's yeah, the CX. I, I the like BX that. is the CX. The BX is the one that caught fire. I like, I like the SM because it's <laughs> weird and it has a. It's a um, or action, but you that's like, backwards. No, you just like the SM because it's the better Chrysler T's in the Maserati. <laughs> I mean, that's not hard. Don't tell that to Test Drive. Oh, I just see Test Drive's hey. new Lexus video. Yeah, I did. I was like, you fucking... It's a Ram! <laughs> a Ram is better than a Lexus in every way. I'm sorry. Oh, sorry. A Lexus is better than a Ram in every way. I'm sorry. It just is. I refuse to believe for a second that that thing is better than Bailey Drive than Alexis. Right. The ramp's a piece it's of it's shit. It. I'm sorry. Hey, hey, hey listen to me. There is one one thing you that explain that is a mystery man. They have the, he is from the fucking Midwest. Yeah, fair enough. I I do for, <laughs> I do forget he is kind of a redneck. So. Yeah, I mean is that just fucking kind of a redneck? He's a well, he's from uh, the same place Zero is from, isn't he? Zero is. Yeah. Yeah. Isn't... I thought Testro was from, like, Michigan or something. No, St. No, Louis. Yes, yeah, St. Louis. You. Missouri. Michigan. Oh, he's from... He's from the same area as Aging Wheels. Yeah. He's done videos yeah. with Aging Wheels. No, he didn't. Wait, yeah, really? he did. He drove his smart car. Did he? Yeah, he drove his smart car in the Wego. Huh. I must find this. I was I watching thought, the smart I, car video the other day. It was quite good. I thought the, uh, I thought the only thing he had did with aging wheels was the tweet about reviews PC for some reason. No, he um, <laughs> thing he drove his Wego. It was funny because it was basically wanna... those two just screaming at each other the entire time like this car's awful. Yeah, this car's awful. <laughs> oh, I need to see the video then. Oh, it's great. <laughs> it is quite good. I just I subscribed yeah. to Aging love, Wheels recently. I need to. Watch I love it. Yeah, I love Aging Wheels. You, get, you need to see his fucking his Yugo video and his fucking okay. um, and his Ford Fiesta video. Oh god, he's done a Fiesta it's video. He owns a Fiesta. Oh yes. What the, the one of the American ones? Yeah. Oh, yeah. He owns a like 2015 Fiesta ST or something like that. Eh, uh, one of those ones. I thought you meant like an original yeah. Mark One Fiesta. I've been like, Ooh. no. The, the Trabant video are also fun. Yeah, I saw owned, I saw the Doug DeMiro review of the Trabant the other day, that's why I subscribed He owns a Saab, well he used to own a Saab, he sold it to some old guy. Good, as you can see with every Saab. What's his name, Invisible oh. AK? 
I'll, I'll send Lane to Brock. Uh, no, this, this sub is like, this sub oh, is like 19, 1960s. Alright. No, seriously. So, I, oh, so it's I actually want, interesting. I want to find he his owns, fucking test drive video. He owns the Wego, the Spark car. And he's still, this Spark car is still trying to shit sell because of these are shit. Yeah, the smart car test drive reviewed it. He was like, yeah, this thing sucks. He owns the uh, Trabant, which I want to fucking drive so bad. I want a Trabant. Go to Missouri. I want to fucking drive this Trabant. I want I want to fucking drag race a Trabant. Against what? He did. He, he, do, he drag raced a fucking. He did a time Scotian. water ball. What? I know what you can drag race against a Trabant. Oh, no. Minor. <laughs> Oh my god. Uh, no, yeah! Oh, uh, now I need to buy a miner and race, just race the fucking trip hand. Make sure no, yes. it. No, you No, you, you need a Yugo. You need a but Yugo. Fucking... You have to saw a fight. But, 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 but the Yugo is a perfectly adequate car. H.A. Wills has proven that. Do you know what we need to do? What? what? We need to get a drag lobby on Horizon 4 of just a bunch of shitboxes to challenge the miners. <laughs> Yes. I will. Oh, I, I text the Make imp. a car worse than the miner. But a uh, fucking. Fucking uh, aging wheels rallied the, the uh, Trebant and drag race through a Trebant. The Trebant tra tra did a quarter mile in 16 seconds. Wow. <laughs> or what, Dude, that's pretty quick if you ask me. I mean, it's light. It that's no mocha. Thing. That's mocha dodge. It is made of cotton, yeah. to be fair. I think. I think it did 16 seconds. The um, like I said, it's Mocha Dodge Demon. I love, I love the uh, trip. I love the trip uh, when he was driving the trip. It's just like, you know, this is a perfect car for a be for a beginner. Everyone's doing it all wrong. You can fo you can focus on what you're doing. Look around. <laughs> okay. Con uh, contemplate your life existence. I seriously can't find this video. CorvetteRacing.com. Did you type in test? Did you type in... What's his name now? Cool stuff and weird cars. That's a fucking name name. Yeah, tell me about it. I it's thought it was... To be fair, I typed in it as weird stuff in cool cars the other day, so... Oh, sorry, cool stuff in weird cars. That was it. That's all like that, I can't remember. I typed it I in the it. wrong way round. I know it's a stupid fucking name, that's what I do know. Ah, yeah. uh, here it is. Found it. Send it. Yeah. Send it in. Put in response or something. I want to okay, check it out. Okay. Okay. Know that I rented a boat. Oh, I fucking hate looking like nuts. I'm going to go for it. Yeah. Good luck. Did you say you rented a boat? <laughs> yeah, that's what I was thinking. There. Yeah. I, I mean, I mean, it's Thank late you, and, and all. Say goodbye. Later, not. Okay. Uh, this weekend, Ludo's. Uh, financially irresponsible decisions. Now GM shall know the wrath of bypassing chassis reinforcement. Indeed. <laughs> oh yeah, 18 Wheels has bought, bought another vehicle. No. Oh no. He's gotta reveal it next week. He's hinted it that it's big and it's got a, a straight six. Ideas? I don't know. I don't know uh, Charger! It's big and it's American and it's gotta be a uh, straight six. So Studebaker. I'm thinking... So I'm thinking... So I'm thinking he's got a fucking... Either an F-150... Oh god. ...and a car line or a bus. I'd say a bus. Red Atlanta full. Cause, cause at the end of the video he said the wheels go... go the wheels go around and round, so... He could have bought a Ford short bus. Sure. No, I, no, he bought like a like a bus bus. No, I'm. I'd love to. I'd love to just I'm, daily a bus. Knowing knowing aging wheels, he probably bought a fucking Vorticon line short bus from the eighties. <laughs> Beautiful. That seems like my type of YouTuber. My well, type of YouTuber is sort of YouTuber who goes, What's up, Drummer Alert Nation? I'm your old killer. Oh. Let's get right into the news. I just need my desk. Good job, you fuck. Oh. 
Don't do that. I just realised something that's going to irritate me for the rest of this video. Oh, Wait until you see the third person view of the Chevy, let me know. Oh no. Yeah? Okay. The red Chevrolet vid decal in the uh, rear window's off center. Oh, for fuck's sake, Emil! I am now going to Emil. use interior view for the rest of this LP episode. Fuck this shit, I'm out. Fuck this shit, Fuck I'm out. No thanks. Oh, I didn't realize it kept going. No, it's like a whole, like, it's like a like, 30 second long song. It's too long. It's like, why the fuck you lying? Use me That's your favorite need slip knot song. Isn't your favorite Slipknot song like 15 minutes long? No, Iowa's not my favorite song. Iowa's just excellent. That favorite Slipknot song? Yeah, oh, that's, diff that's difficult. It's Iowa. Oh, I refuse any other answer. Cause <laughs> no, the they, one you actually all of my favorite ones are like 4 to 5 minutes long. So. That's still too long. Well, I know. Like, AK, I mean, one of their, I mean, one of their best songs was 2 and a half minutes long. Like, okay. And include, okay, okay, included okay, great lines, included great lines like suck my fucking cock and you suck, they suck, guess what, get fucked. Get fucked. I can't think of any other words to say but fuck. Fuck. Loving them lyrics. Don't get triggered over opinions, our opinions are great. Okay. Okay, bear in mind, you are talking to someone whose ideal song length is over 10 minutes. That's why he likes Iowa so much. Right. It's progressive. It is that actually technically Iowa is kind of progressive. It's proggy. It's all yeah, because it actually takes about six minutes for them to actually say a word, other than. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that's the thing. The, the song does. The, the song does only have two like two. It only has two verses, and then like the rest of it's just going. Aah! <laughs> As he starts cutting himself with glass. That's my, that's, <laughs> so, my, that's my, that's my, that's my favorite part of Mule, just the people going. Yeah. Well, that's good because it's twelve minutes of that. After the bass. You know what, Emil? That's that's what your theme song is just gonna be. It's just gonna be. Bing, bing, me bing, bing, playing bing. open string, and then you going. Yeah. <laughs> yes. <laughs> it's just me doing the end. But yeah, I don't know. Best little song. It's cut, it's a, I can't even My say the name of it. Sacatastrophe or whatever it's called is quite good. Uh, My favorite Slipknot song is Backcountry. <laughs> fuck off. Backcountry is not even the best Avengers Sevenfold song. I hate no, Backcountry. Saints Row 2 made me hate Backcountry. It's like, there's two Avengers Sevenfold songs that I've heard to death so I don't like them anymore. As bad as that sounds. Which one? Backcountry and Almost Easy. Give me fucking a little piece of heaven. That's what we all need in our lives. What we need. Have you is... heard that one, Sam? Yes, a bit, yeah. Have you heard the whole thing? No. Uh, I, I don't usually listen to I haven't been in a metal core movie, so I don't. Uh, a little piece Eventually of heaven is great. Essentially, the story of it is um, a guy and a girl. He proposes to a girl, she laughs in his face, he stabs her, he has sex with her corpse. Her corpse wakes up, stabs him to death, th 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 stuff happens, they get married at the end. <laughs> Reminds me of something Man, that's a very good love story. Problem. And the great- and they call it oh, 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 by the way, there's the best- I, have, I, I haven't told you the best bit about this. There's zombies? There's an animated music video to go with it. No, yeah, I know. And also that's the chorus has the best- one of the best lines in metal. Is that ironically or unironically? I got a toaster for your thighs. <laughs> I agree. That is the best line I've ever. No, and just all music in general. I need to listen to oh, the wait, nothing, music. Wait, nothing will be, um, I repeat myself under stress, repeated five oh, times. Oh, I don't know, the best event seven for the time is probably Blinded and James from the most one. That one's really good. Mm -hmm. That's got a fucking oh, kick-ass bass on it. 2005 or 2012. Yeah. The good one, 05. I don't know what. I don't know what any of the music in 2012 is. I didn't play it that much. There's a Green Day song. Great, cool. Wow. There's a Green Day. There's and a Green Day. My car into a green. There's a fucking Green Day song in Transformers 2. That don't make it good. Is there? Yeah, 21 Guns. 
Oh. They're shouting. Yeah, my mom's yelling at my dog. Oh, I know what the best Slipknot song is. What? Oh, scissors. <laughs> Please explain. It's about Please performing your... open heart surgery on yourself. Oh, well, that's kind of hot. That sounds pleasant. Purity is quite good. That's about being in a box, dying. Um, Eyeless is quite good. That's about homeless people screaming at you. Disaster like, piece is quite good. That's about murdering people. Um, um, the nameless is quite good. That's about I don't actually know. Um, that's the best song from Volume Three because the rest of Volume Three is a bit. Yeah. Oh, there's duality as well from Volume Three. That's all right. That's about sticking your fingers in your own eyes. Um, <laughs> oh, that's lovely. Um, it's what I do every Tuesday evening. Fort album's quite good. Um, I don't know what most of the songs in that really mean. They actually, they had meaning in those, which I mean, they're good songs at all, but like meaning really, who needs that in that not song? Devil in Eyes quite good. The entire music video is all the band members committing suicide. <coughs> That's pleasant. That's cultured. Yeah, uh, the lead singer blows his own head off with explosives. Um, I haven't heard that before. Lead guitarist rips his face off. Uh, As a, I think the a DJ message. eats his oh. own arm. Oh. Um, the guy with the spikes on his head gets eaten by a dog. Uh, the guy who has the nose that he jerks off, I'm not joking, uh, gets pecked to death by birds. That was great watching the making of video for that because they were like, he was like, Chris, how do you want to die? I want to be pecked to death by birds. You hate birds, don't you? Yes, fucking hate them. <laughs> hey. This is so hey. edgy of birds. Yes, um, some guy does a full body explosion where his head comes off. That's quite cool. Um, what's the rest of them? The two new members get stabbed to death. Um, and then finally a clown sets himself on fire and then hangs himself. Emil. And the best bit is, no, no, the best bit is in the making of, for that, they was just like, me, you know the deal, set myself on fire, hang myself, you can clean up the fucking mess. <laughs> it's just like, cool. Emil, yes? you know something? I finally understand how much it fucking sucks for you guys when I talk about the bands that I like. Yeah! Because yeah. literally no one fucking cares. That Slipknot's <laughs> great, man. Yeah, no, I don't give a fuck. Exactly. I do. In fact, I, I, I texted as a remind me never to talk texted about Slipknot. Texted him? Why, is he giving you his Texted number? what? Oh god. Yeah. I, it's, it's fucking, it's boneless texting. Let's oh, be Barry, real. Oh, Sunset Peninsula in reverse. Yeah. By the way, apparently the last song I played on my phone was Country Roads Take Me Home, so... God. Okay, <laughs> finally. Finally, something I can agree recently, with you on. Recently, right, recently played Country Roads, uh, Blackbird by Alter Bridge, Two Tar Tribes by Frankie Goes to Hollywood, the best driving song in the world. All Out Life, Slipknot, 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 stuff. There's some Megadeth in there. Okay. And the last go. song, the last song I've listened to is Amethyst, Amethyst Realm by Claypool Lenham Delirium. That sounds gay. It, it is does. really good. That's not so But about. it's made, it's made by John Lennon's kids, so. Oh, I hate good. John Lennon. He's a wanker. I mean, he was a douchebag IRL, told me. Yeah. And his wife's a complete <laughs> fucking idiot. Oh, her, his wife is a cunt. I also had to look at her she, bush she once because she was made... naked on an album cover. I don't want to look at her. <laughs> She literally made a... I mean, there was John Lennon's bare penis as well, but I was just focusing on the mountain of fucking muff hair. I guess okay, it was no, the look. 70s, then, so... <laughs> mountain of muff hair, is that what we're calling this? No. <laughs> <laughs> Actually... <laughs> okay. Okay. I'll Here's write that down. <laughs> Paul was the worst musician to ever live. You know how I know this? Hmm? She made... John Lennon's kid, not Sean, but the other one. She made him pay money for his father, dead father's letters. Never liked Yoko Ono. I never who, liked any of them. The liked, Beatles were shit. They only had one good member. It's Paul McCartney, and Wings is better than Beatles. So. You are wrong, sir. Listen, no, Band on the Run is better than any Beatles song, including I'm the Walrus. 
No. Um, the Jody. best, the best Beatles song is obviously Revolution Number no. Nine. All Beatles songs are shit. I'm sorry. Mm. No, Revolution, no, no, guys. Revolution Number no. Nine. Do you know what I prefer? Well, Revolution Dead Death Squad by Dragon Force. <laughs> Here's the thing, Emil. That song, song is shit. Revolution 9 is shit. It's like the most experience. It's like my music on steroids. I thought he was going to say Dragon Force is shit. I was going to say Dragon Force is great. No, they're not. I, I was going they're to okay. ban you from life. They're okay. I love they're not using my type of music. They made a really fucking good cover of Ring of Fire. That, um, fucking. I love that Through the Fire and Flames music video where they're just sat there performing guitar solos while drinking from a can of, like, Monster. And each time, <laughs> each time the guy's played his line, he just like fucking. They just put the guitars down and just casually start sipping from this thing, and then just pick them up again when it's their time and just go mental. <laughs> it's great. If I, if I remember right, it wasn't monster. It was like they were like drinking beer or something. Oh, I don't I know. It was some it. fucking black, undiscreet can of some bullshit. Through the fire and flames is good. Um, yeah, Fury of the Storm was good. It is a, it's a good song. Operation Ground and Pound, Revolution Death Squad, it's all good shit. I don't know, it, you need to be in the mood to listen to Dragon Force to be fair, but... That's yeah. how I am yeah. with metal. Metal's yeah, always good, like... because metal reminds me that we're all gonna die soon. And that you know, makes me happy. <coughs> Emil. There was a time when I was so angry that even Slayer was too soft. I want you to die! Slow death! I shall die! I shall die! I'm from a spatcher! Azza, do you know what this means? Angel of death. Oh, do you know what we? Do you know what you need in your life, AK? Oh, you need Slayer's where? album that was released on September 11th. You need God hates us all. What is it, AK? What did you want? It's a song about do you know how what God hates us all. Mean? No, what, AK? What did you say? Do you know what any of this means? But no, I don't. Azza loves good. Slayer. I don't know what you're talking about. No, I. <laughs> <laughs> Azza loves Raining Blood. Everyone loves Raining Blood. Raining Blood, Blood is a good sh song, I'll say that much. Oh, the, that entire album's Angel great because it's just half an hour of fuck you. It's great. Because every song. I haven't listened to the every, entire album. Every song for that half an hour sounds exactly the same. It makes half an hour feel like um, four and a half minutes. If, it's by, if by listening True. to this, that album, I become slightly as anywhere near as boring as you are, I'd rather not. No, me and Sam just sort of like to argue about music. It's like the only thing we have in common. No, and mm. we barely have anything in common there. That's Exa the worst part. Yeah, I know, that's why we argue about it. Yeah. It's like I, it's like, like AK's opinions on cars, because they're wank, and his opinion on music. Hey. Your, See, music, like, your music taste is the wankiest, spunkiest thing I've ever seen. Guaranteed better than my music taste. No, I'd rather listen to your music than his shit. Because I have to put up with no, his shit. What is your music taste? But it's a lot. Ow! It's a music taste. You like Ava Max, don't you, Emil? Who? Ava Max. Fuck. Is that a new perfume? <laughs> no, that's the sweet but psycho woman. Oh, no, yeah, no, yeah, Emil. It is a new perfume. There's only one thing that. She has a new song on it, Emil. You'd love it. No, oh, okay. I have a band Years and Years is like the only new thing I actually don't years hate. Years and Years are good. They're, they're okay. I, 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 I shouldn't good. like them, but I do for some reason because they make catchy ass music. Fine, loose fault DM, yeah. Did you like yeah, the Scissor Sisters? <laughs> okay, the I have a band. <laughs> do you I not remember? <laughs> I have a band that is so are. great. Azza, do you remember Listen. them? What? Do you remember the Scissor Sisters? <laughs> yes. Cause you're poison. <laughs> they were shit. They had like one good song, and the rest of them oh. were shit. Yeah. Oh Jesus. Do I even want to hear our songs? No, like... you don't want to listen to us. This. It's like listening to Thank an you. S Club Seven song. You just don't want to do what it. The fuck is this? Or like Alpha Beat. Alpha Beat. What? As I swear, your ass is stuck in 2012. What? My ass was stuck in 2012. That was the last force of rising into our good music. 
Horizon 3 and Horizon 4 are good, and Horizon 3. Does it? I don't know, I turned them... Horizon 3 has a decent soundtrack, Horizon 4 is shit. As I had to listen like to it. me for an hour and a half, try to kill the music in the game, he laughed. Yeah, because I changed one. the radio to one and it still kept fucking playing, so every time I boot the game up now I have to put it in streamer mode and then the music does not play. The main menu song's okay, but like only the cut that's actually on the main menu because apparently it starts like halfway through the song, the first half of the song is spunk. A Blondie's good. Blondie? Yeah, not the no. 70s Blondie. Newborn. Ace is you. I can't stand well, I don't know. I don't listen to it. Hey, Atomic's a good um, song. I don't know. <laughs> Atomic is a good song. Everything else is a bit. Yeah. Pat Benatar. That's a fucking. That that sort of thing. Oh, you're music. Saying, The only Blondie song I know is Call Me. And you don't know Heart of Glass? I probably heard it, but I don't know the name. Yeah, if you heard Heart of Glass, you'd know what it is. And also Atomic's good. My dad is my dad has the worst taste out of everyone. Oh my dad has a great taste in music. My no, dad I have a fucking terrible taste of music. Your taste is okay, Adla. No, it's not. It's okay. I've no, seen worse, like a meal. My father's into a bunch of white stuff that you wouldn't expect him to be. It's interesting. Trap rap? No, he's a massive Led Zeppelin fan. <laughs> Road oh, America. I totally expect that. He's, Here's what is it, he's Zeppelin, Sabbath, uh, Chili Peppers, uh, he, he's also got some like weird stuff like Fun Loving Criminals which is like, weird, and Squeeze, and the Happy Mondays, the Happy Mondays is great by the way, just put that and Squeeze. Okay. I, as My a, father. Agree with me, Squeeze is great, yeah, Squeeze, <laughs> Squeeze is great, Cool for Cats squeeze. is a great song. The Indians send signals okay. for the rocks above the path. The cowboys take positions in the bushes on the grass. Yeah, squeeze. Okay. <laughs> Best so band father, ever. <laughs> if I tell you his two favorite, his two favorite bands, you think he doesn't have, he would have a pretty good music taste. AK, I need you to listen to a song. One of them anti I'm going to listen to Squeeze. <laughs> I need, you can listen to Squeeze, but I need you to uh, listen to something else. I think you'll quite like it. It's, oh, uh, it, it's called buggy. Force Gender Realignment. Oh. <laughs> is it on Spotify? <laughs> no, but it is on YouTube. and it, oh, Well, it was on YouTube. It's now on Pornhub exclusively. Um, <laughs> because it's basically... It's like King Crimson's first album. I'll get distracted if we go on there. That's true. <laughs> Ask well, me, I suppose I your right hand is your best friend. Then. Indeed. Hey! I did tell Tank. I told Tank to listen to King Crimson. I told him to the only place you could find their first album without buying the CD was on porn. Oh, don't listen to him. King Crimson shit. Well, he likes Rush. Kanye so West. He is, might like Kanye West has the better version of Schizo, man. You are wrong. I, I am. Love Power is a much better song than Schizo, man. Power is a great song. Power is a great. It song. Power is a great. Song. Is a good, strong is a good song as well. Yeah, Flashing Lights is a good Blake. song as well. And for. Robert Fripp is a god. And that uh, thingy song he did was quite good as well. That one with uh, Rihanna and Jay-Z. That one was quite good. I don't know that one. He wasn't the best well, bit in that song. But he said, I know like one of his things is like, please no Volvos or something like that. Which was funny. <laughs> Speaking of, how's what? the Volvo? My Volvo. It's fine. Oh, I don't have a Volvo. AK, you have a Volvo. How's the Volvo? My parents do. Yeah, well, you're driving it. How's the Volvo? <laughs> How is it? Have you figured out what Volvo it is yet? It's, no, <laughs> they've got a new one. They got. The, I thought they had a Mazda. The black one. Yeah, I know there's no, a black, they still have the black one. one. I don't know either of my parents' Volvos are. You drive the black one, don't you? Or have to. I, I, I've drove it a couple of times. I've refused now. So what, do, what, the, what do you drive now? Nothing. <laughs> at the moment. Because the Saab's been hey, taking care of a guy named Brad. <laughs> like I keep saying, but a guy named Brad. Who is Brad? Do you know him or? I think Brad, it's I his don't, lover. I don't want to, as I. Because when I went into the garage, Brad was trying to eat a yogurt with a pen on it. I don't <laughs> what? want to. <laughs> what? <laughs> ah, sound like a gen general Saab tech. <laughs> yeah, they really had to uh, scrape the barrel to find Saab techs at this point. 
<laughs> Everyone who wants to work on my fucking thing. <laughs> Surprised he wasn't like sticking crayons up his nose. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Jesus. He's the thickest human I've ever met. He's genuinely. Like, why, what was he I, I mean, that's coming from you. You can eat your yoga with a pen. You can eat your with a pen. That's, that, that's how I feel inside. Ah! You're the voice trying to understand it. Make a... I'm sorry, but how the fuck do you eat yogurt with a pen, pen lid? Was he eating it? Was he like shoveling it up with the big bit of a pen lid, or was he like sucking it through the tiny hole? No, I it was trying. He was using was he it as a spoon. A sucking it through the hole. <laughs> no, he was using it as a spoon and trying to <laughs> eat the, the yogurt with the big bit. I don't know. The receptionist was even worse. I, oh I no! Never know. Receptionist. Her name was Cheryl, I think, or something. Oh, her yeah. name's Cheryl. That's how you know she's. Good she, she she looked like a piece of wet scrambled egg, just sitting <laughs> on a chair. To be fair, I went into an Audi dealership recently, and everyone in there is just a fucking blonde bimbo. It's great. <laughs> mm. To confirm, after walking around Audi. Fucking my god, does the Audi A1 look like a Ford Focus? Um, I thought you said Audi. <laughs> Same, I was questioning. No, the Audi A4 is neat. I like the A4. The A6 like looks good now. I want an A8. Because it's... I want a Q. Uh, dirty bastard. Get a Bentayga, it's better. No, oh, you. I want Bentayga, it's too expensive. <laughs> So is a Q8! <laughs> Q8 is only 90k. Why don't you just get... The Volkswagen still Why making tall reg? Why can't I have oh, a no. Audi Q7 V12 twin turbo diesel? Because it gets 3 miles to the gallon and none of them yeah, are left. True. I want a BMW Q8, Q7. I like oh that. no. That's cool. We've lost them. It's a BMW Shit. though. I know, I so? get you're a bit of a wank pheasant, but like, you don't need that anymore. <laughs> BMW is crap, most of the time. Only like seven The only good the BMW X7. is like, the M2. I quite like the M2. The only good BMW is a dead BMW. The only fucking BMW I like, like, I remotely care about is the fucking E9. The fucking 92, only yeah, because of the fucking V8. Um, the, oh, um, the M8 is what also about? extremely ugly and extremely large. What about the fucking... Oh, but the GTE exists because it's fucking big. Yeah, the big man. Okay, you can't speak nonsense. No. No one. My question is, what about that fucking BMW with the weird doors? What, the Which I8? Which one? Like, one. The I, yeah. I saw an I8 today. Did you the vomit? I've no, I, I, my sister I've was in the car. I proceeded to shout while the windows was open. Like, oh, look, big wanker's over there in his Mini Cooper diesel. <laughs> <laughs> he had a private plate on it and everything. I was like, you fucking wanker. You can pick up an i8 for like 20k now. Yeah, it's quite funny. you can pick up an i3 for yeah. like 10p and, not rich and a packet of anymore. fucking Snickers. So. Mm -hmm. Because it's not the cool hot thing anymore. Never yeah, yeah, people realized it wasn't a fucking supercar like it was promised. I love how I still love how the i8 looks like it's giving birth to a 911. It does. And when you realize, I mean, I that, it it like it's I'm not bothered it. by how it looks. I'm just bad bothered by how it looks. I am bothered by how it looks because from the front it does look nice. From the back, no, it doesn't. I don't think it looks good from any angle. I've always had an issue with it. I always thought it looked fucking awful. Maybe I'm just not into super modern designs, but it's like... The last good-looking BMW was... Fucking, what, the E39? To be fair, I'm not into super modern des the M2's designs, which is why I fucking love the gym. The gym? They all... They all... The Anyone who doesn't like the gym? The gym? <laughs> Oh, I, what is I, I love the gym. It's the chimney with half its arse missing. It's the pickup truck chimney. It's called Jim. Suzuki Jim. <laughs> oh, no, sorry, it's called it's, it, it, it's called the Suz Jim. I'm sorry, but fucking all BMWs look the same as me. It's like Audis. Same here. 
I'm with yeah. Audi's not looks stiff. No, the right. BMW 3 Series looks different now. It's pretty it bare like what I had. And the, it's it pretty. Does, it's, it screams like That's why the M1 is so amazing to me. I mean, it's, it's pretty bad when we're doing the thumbnails, so I had to ask you which Audi. <laughs> oh, yeah, that was great. Scotian, when we was doing the Rivals episodes, uh, Scotian actually asked to, I had that to ask me, he's like, what Audi is that? And it's like, how do you not know what Audi is? And he's just like, I just don't know, they all look the same. It's, it's, it's got I a mean, big grill and big wheels, and that's all I know. It's got four doors. Which one? <gasps> we reached level a... five with a car! <laughs> no! <laughs> Holy shit. Pistons and compression. <laughs> Ten I'll be right half. back. Anyways, 32,000 credits in my... Does that say cum nozzle? <laughs> Anyways, thank you all very much for watching. Next time, we are going to finish off the North American tour with a look at the <laughs> Class R1 North American tour. Join us for that. Until then, uh, farewell. Well.